Hey y'all, it's your girl Maria and we are back with another one. Sandra, thank you for your continuing support on Patreon for me. Um, like I said, it's Patreon day. So if you are a patron, um, you get one free song per month moved up to the front of the line and I cover those song reactions. And so Sandra gave me Humphrey. He, she gave me story time with Tim and it looks like it's watch me whip and nay nay. And I've got to tell you, oh yeah, we're watching this. I have I had such a great time with them when I saw them in concert. And like I was, it was incredible. Like when I saw them and then Tim, he hits the bass notes, the entire room vibrates. I mean, I still cannot get over that. Um, there's so much going on in their concerts. And then you forget that there's no instruments. You really do. You forget there's no instruments when they're singing. They just do such a, a remarkable job that, you know, the, the instruments are just not necessary and, and you don't even miss it. So anyway, um, that being said, you already know if you want to show love and support to the artist and or myself, because you know you want to. Remember, description box below, I link ways for you to do that there. At the very least, make sure you do it for the artists, help them grow their channel. Um, this one is a live performance at U of M. Um, and so I don't know what the quality of the video is gonna be, but we're gonna take a listen to it anyway, okay? Let's go ahead and get started. Story time with Tim. <laughs> it's a new bit that somehow has become a staple in the show. I'm not sure how. And I'm also out of stories, so I don't know why we're continuing to do this. Uh, well, I know one reason is that that last song is usually the end of Act One, and we run off stage and pant for the next 10 minutes. Uh, but we're going to go into this next song, so this is a chance for us to catch our breath. <laughs> I love this part. You and since I don't have a story for you, <laughs> I'm just gonna I'm just gonna read <laughs> some poignant lyrics. This first one is from one of my favorite songs from 25 years ago, and then we'll follow it up with something a little more current. The lyrics are, in every heart there is a room, a sanctuary safe and strong, to heal the wounds from lovers past until a new one comes along. I spoke to you in cautious tones, you answered me with no pretense, and still I feel I said too much, my silence is my self-defense. And every time I've held a rose, it seems I only felt the thorns. And so it goes, and so it goes. And so will you soon, I suppose. So I will choose to be with you. That's if the choice were mine to make. But you can make decisions too. And you can have this heart to break. Isn't that nice? Yeah. That really hits home. That's, that's really nice. That's that, powerful. That song um, made it to uh, 35 on the charts. And now we're going to do one from this year that made it to the top of the charts. You already know who it is. Silento. 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 <laughs> Wait, he's... So he's going to read the lyrics? I mean, 35 years ago, the lyrics to songs were like everything. And I've heard this song. And there's not really a whole lot to the lyrics. <laughs> and the way that he's reading it has just a hint of sarcasm that I, I have to appreciate so much from these guys. Okay. We're, we're just going to keep going. <laughs> Gonna do it for me. Are you kidding? Now, no. watch me whip. <laughs> <laughs> now watch me nay nay. <laughs> now watch me 
fucking whip. <laughs> now, watch me nay nay. <laughs> I love it. Ooh, watch me, watch me. Ooh, watch me. Watch me. Very narcissistic. See, here's the thing. None of the other guys could pull this off except for Tim because of the sound and tone of his voice. The sarcasm that comes from it is very natural from him. And I don't think any of the other guys would be able to match the tone here of how he's reading it. it, 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 it it's because of that that it's funny. It's not even, you know anything special that he's doing other than reading from his phone. But the tone sounds sarcastic and it's just the way he speaks. I, I freaking love this. This is hilarious. I, none of the other guys would be able to pull this off. He's the right guy to do that. Ooh, watch me. Watch me. Oh, very narcissistic. Ooh. Watch me, watch me. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> Do the stinky leg. Do the stinky leg. Do the stinky leg. Don't act like you don't like it. Do the stinky leg. Thank you. <laughs> now break your legs. <laughs> no, that's that thing, huh? Like that. Yeah, okay, cool. Break your legs. Break them, dog. <laughs> Tell them break your legs. Break them, break them. Now watch me. Bop. This. this is great. Now watch me whip. <laughs> watch me nay nay. Now watch me whip whip. Watch me nay nay. Can you do it? Now watch me yule. Now watch me Superman. <laughs> the fact that Austin knows the moves to this makes it even funnier because it's just given an extra added element of comedy to this whole thing. But he's just reading it out completely. There is no singing with this and it's absolutely hilarious. It's definitely stage worthy. Um, I, I really wish they continued doing something like this you know, in, in their concerts. It doesn't seem like they do anymore. I don't know. I haven't been to a non-Christmas concert. So if you guys have been to a non-Christmas concert, are they still doing this? Because, yeah, this is hilarious. Now watch me Yule. <laughs> Superman. <laughs> now watch me duff, 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 duff. <laughs> Hold on. Now watch me duff, 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 duff. I can't believe this is happening right now. <laughs> Watch me bop, 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 bop. Ooh, watch me, watch me. Oh my god. Ooh, watch me, watch me. Put a little emotion in the
my god, this is why I love them to death. I seriously do because it's so funny. <laughs> they really do play off of each other. It's great. <laughs> <laughs> No, that was awesome. I love it. I absolutely loved that. That was hilarious. Um, I I was not expecting that kind of a story time, but <laughs> it was really great. That was a lot of fun. I could not picture a better ending or scenario for this. And, and, and this is why I love these guys. But again, Tim's voice is the perfect voice for this to pull off all the sarcasm. And just the fact that his, like the rest of the, like Rob and, and Austin and Chris and and, um, and Adam, they were just sitting there just looking at him like, I can't believe this guy's doing this. And they're laughing. Like, it's so fun watching them play off of one another. This was a lot of fun. I enjoyed it a lot. If you guys did too, you know what to do. Make sure you check it out. Remember, it's in the description box below. In the meantime, live your lives fabulously. And I will see you on the next one. Bye. <laughs>